I want to ask you, what are the top 10 tunes on, in, on your current playlist? Do they include anything beyond the United States or North American or Northern Hemisphere popular music? If, I'm going to pitch a class to you, which is this introductory class to world music and cultures. This doesn't mean that we're going to cover the world. So if you come from India, we're going to cover Indian music. Or if you come from Peru, we're going to cover Peruvian music. No, what I'm going to do is, is select a handful of musical cultures that we will go into some a little bit of depth to under, get some understanding of what um, music means in a, in a sort of original cultural context and place. And then we're going to talk about how that music has traveled the world, how it has come into our own kind of cultural spaces and popular music um, spaces. For example, do you know that um, Madonna has used pygmy hoots? Well, versions of pygmy hoots, copies of pygmy hoots that were done actually by Herbie Hancock um, in one of her songs. Did you know, for example, that um, Australian Aboriginal people have incorporated rock music to raise consciousness about um, land rights for Aboriginal peoples and actually done it very successfully? They've actually had the government come in and change the law because of the music that they made. These are the kinds of stories that we're going to cover in this class. We will just do a handful of them in the amount of time that we have. In the end, what my goal for you is A, to change what's on your playlist, to be more adventurous, to become an explorer of the world of music. We will only use publicly accessible and free resources that are available to you online. So you will then be able to go back to those resources and find your own musical cultures and do your own kinds of reading and research once you have um, completed the class. So we're changing the playlist, but I also want you to think about how you encounter cultural and musical difference in, in your own world. We live in a very fast changing world. People are encountering newness all the time and we often are resistant to it. And my hope is that by doing a class on world music and cultures, you will in fact begin to embrace difference. Even if you don't like it, at least you will have an openness and tolerance towards it.